All right, we're down here again. This time I brought Jordan with me. The beach totally changed again. Looks like there's a huge cut now. And uh, hopefully there's still coins. It looks kind of, I don't know. We'll have to find out. Um, hopefully there's gold actually. But I'm using the Equinox 600. And somebody asked me why did I get the 600 and not the 800? Because at the time when I got it, there was no 800s to be had. Everybody bought them all. So I just went with the six because it doesn't really matter. Anyways, so that's that. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get out. I don't care if I get wet. Let's see if this wave hits this cut hard. Yeah, that's not bad. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna hit it. All right, so I just got down here and there is, there's still coins everywhere. There's one there, there's some here. Just everywhere, there. They're everywhere, so I don't know what to do if I should just look for a low tone. I'm gonna get wet, I know it. All right, let's try digging one. There's like so many targets. Those are just coins though. One big wave and I'm done for. I, that was a dime, I think. Yeah. But tons of coins, tons of coins. All right, I decided to just look for low tones. And there's one right there. But it's right in the middle of a bunch of coins, so. It should be in there. You hear all the coins with it. Ah, here we go. There's another one. A little low tone. Let's see what this one was. This one, it was a nickel, so it was a it was a low tone. Jordan just got down here. <laughs> so he's gonna go crazy with all these sounds. He's using the Excalibur. I mean it really is insane. There we go. A nickel and a dime and one scoop. Alright, I'm gonna turn the camera on. I dug a bunch of keys the other day and here's another one. So this is good. This is good. Not just coins. I almost don't need my metal detector today. Just scoop and see what it is. <laughs> Holy smokes. It's like I can't even tell if you can't like dump it out and see if you got a target. There's so many targets. And if I keep digging down, it'll probably just be more targets, more targets. This is a blank spot. I think I got that one. But I can't tell though. I think I got it. Hey, another, it's another key. Two keys. Let's keep going. Look at this. Uh, I haven't hit this area yet, but look. There's a quarter. There's a penny or nickel. There's a dime. There's a penny. There's a dime, and there's another quarter. <laughs> I just wait here and watch. There's like coins everywhere. Oh, look. <laughs> it's like a washer. It looked like a ring for a minute there. Insane. Look at it. Oops, I'm dumping them out now. I forgot I had them in there. Oh, well. Uh, where was that? I just saw one. Oh, there's a coin. There's a quarter. Ah, stop. I'm going to turn my detector off and just start eyeballing them. So that, there's that many coins. 
<laughs> you can you hear all that? That's all coins. It's crazy. That's why I'm going through this like looking for low tones. Can't wait to show Jordan this video. Oh, here's one. Here's a dime. Looks like one's right here, probably. We'll just say it was. Just look for dark spots on the sand now. Every time the water comes up, it washes out new coins. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh crap, there's a big wave. Wash them off and see what we got. Just, just, just from not detecting. But you, you can hear all the coins. I mean, it's insane. That was pretty cool. I've never had that happen. I just looked around. I was like, "What? There's coins everywhere." I see one right now. <laughs> Look at all those. Didn't even have to dig them. But it is nice to get them out of the ground. There's one here. Let's get it. Probably just a dime. I think when I stir up the ground, they actually come out. But what I'm looking for is gold. Yikes. Oh no. What did I get myself into here? If that water hits this wall really hard, it's going to knock me. But on the other hand, it might free up some more coins. Dang, see all that? It's all coins. There's a quarter in there somewhere. Like I said, you don't even need a detector today. I can just go around scooping. Of course, I missed that one. Look, here's a quarter. <laughs> Top vine. Here's a quarter. Here's another quarter. Uh, I, want, I want to see a gold ring pop out of the ground. Just eyeball it. That'd be so cool. But, Oh no. Alright, let's go back. There's gotta be more coins now. <laughs> looking for gold, looking for gold. Not even using my detector. Eyeball my first ring or something. I may have eyeballed one before. Now, there's two quarters. No, my goal is to get as many coins as I can today anything else I get with it that's just extra that might be gold <laughs> I was walking along and I got a seven I was like yep yeah, that could be gold well it's really not I mean it's heavy but it's really thin well let's see when we get home here's a nine ten Hopefully I got it. I still feel... No, I don't think I got it. Oh, that one. I don't see any gold. So that's done. I must not got it. So oh, that's what it was. A uh, swivel from fishing. There's still a 10 down there. Could be something. <laughs> Alright, I think we got it in the scoop. And nothing. <laughs> It is here. I just missed it. And there's no place I can like set it down. Oh, maybe right here. Well, then I actually look for it. Let's see if I can get it. 
Anything other than a coin is what I'm looking for. It's not usually like that. But today... Can I feel something? Uh, it's just a little screw. It's okay though, it wasn't a coin. <laughs> So I'm going to walk back down this way and see if I can eyeball some more. There's a different sound with a coin right here. I'll just pick that one up. Here's one here. Another dime. Jeez, there's just coins everywhere. What's that? I forgot what I was digging here. There it is. Just a nickel. Alright, I'll tell you guys if I get anything cool. I'm still picking up a lot of coins, but I just decided to just turn the camera on because this one's a low tone. Look, there's a 12 right there. I think that's the sound I'm after. Oh, I saw something. Was it something? No. Too shiny what I saw. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, there it is. Watch when I do my wrap up, you'll see a lot of nickels. So I'm digging, I'm just going for the gold, you know. So, there we go, another nickel. But I have to dig the nickels because they could be gold. <laughs> Jordan's like, he got a ring already. But he's like, I can't even move. <laughs> uh. Alright, I think I got it, whatever it is. See, I gotta dig 16s too, because I, I, I uh, tested a platinum ring on it, and it came up as a 16. That's a fishing weight. At least it wasn't another coin. <laughs> There's the nickel I was trying. I knew, I, I knew there was a nickel in there somewhere. Yep. Nickel. Another coin now. Uh. So now I need to walk back because the waves have came up a few more times. Hey, Jordan eyeballed the silver, I think, so like a pendant. So I'm gonna keep walking around looking for stuff. Got one. It might be fake. Uh, it might be another class ring. I think it's 10k. It's got that green. All right, I was just looking for low tones again. Look <laughs> at that gold ring, here's a 10. I'm just looking for gold now. Forget those coins, I like the gold. I see something, I think. Oh, what's this? What's this? It's a piece of junk, maybe? That looks like it says something on it. We'll check that when we get home. It looks like a, it looks like a puzzle piece. It is a puzzle piece. 
Oh, and there's the hole. It's a pendant. Oh, cool. Pendant. All right. We're on a roll. Gold. And the only ringing up is two. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, baby. Look at that, baby. Oh, and it's a whole bracelet. <laughs> nice. I was just showing Jordan. Uh, there's about five grams. <laughs> nice thick chain. Very nice. Wow. I was, I was like, oh, that's a two three. I'm gonna try to get it. I'm digging anything other than coins. So I might not get very much silver. But that's two golds already. Gold ring and a gold bracelet. How awesome is that? And I think that's my second class ring. I got class ring yesterday here. I'm gonna keep going. <laughs> oh my gosh. Look at that one. It was just right there, dude. Oh my gosh. Yeah. That one might not be real. No, it's real. <laughs> it's real. I can see it from here, it's real. I had one just like that. <laughs> wow. That hit the jackpot on that. Yeah. Let's see it. Oh, it's broken. Oh well. I don't know, that broken part almost looked... It almost looked fake. Yeah, it looks fake, huh? Doesn't even feel that heavy, huh? That yeah. kind of that kind of looks rusted. That pendant. Yeah, that. Don't I'm not really sure about this so one. It doesn't have that weight. Let's see what it rings up as. Well, it rings up at five, so it rings up real. Rings up in gold. Yeah. So it probably is, huh? I think it it might be fake. That's okay, I already got you. Yeah. Alright, there's a two, three. Never thought I'd see the day I was digging twos and threes. Try the pinpointer again. Oh man. I'm looking for small targets. Oh, there it is. I found a piece of a toe ring. Just on a small target, so I figured it's probably silver. Oh, that, that is something. Definitely a piece of jewelry. All right. I think I just got another gold, yep. <laughs> nice. This couldn't be my best gold day ever. This has stones in it. And it's definitely gold. <laughs> nice one. Pink stones. Look how deep my hole is. Look what I got in my scoop. <laughs> Another ring. This is a big one. This one's got some weight to it. Although, it looks kind of fake. Oh, yeah. Well, that might just be where it's been resized. We'll check that one when we get home. Yeah, it's been resized. So why would you resize a ring if it wasn't real? 
It could be real. We'll check that one when we get home. Oh my gosh, I just went outside of the area and it's got a little signal. And I was just like, oh, I'll dig it. And it just got deeper, deeper. Let's see what it rings up as. Oh, yeah, it's real. 1918. Cool. Just got another ring. <laughs> I thought I was digging a quarter. I just gave up and said, I'm going to dig some quarters. So that means it's probably silver. Because uh, of the way it's tarnished. Pretty cool, though. Ah. So I'm way away from where all the targets are, but here's another one. It's just like that silver ring ring up. It's like real high. 30s. Oh, now there's nothing. Let's have it. Yeah, that's just a quarter. But let's see. Maybe it's not a quarter. <laughs> it is. It's just a quarter. <laughs> because I got that gold ring right here, and then I got that silver ring right here. So I figured, you know what, I might as well... And there's not many signals right here. It's not like over there. I just pulled this out. It looks like gold, but I don't think it is. I mean, it's cold colored, but... It's almost too heavy to be gold. Anyways, I don't even know what that's from. It'd be the world's smallest bracelet. Huh. Look around, maybe I chopped it. Yeah, there might be more of it in there. There's a high signal too, so... Oh yeah, that's probably it. Cause it's ringing up the same. Just real cruddy. Holy smokes. Oh, uh, uh, I don't know what the heck it is. But this penny should have been ringing up way louder than it was. Maybe it's not a penny. That's crazy. I believe I got that ring, that big one. I hope it's real. This might be like one of my best hunts. I believe I missed it. <laughs> Stuff just jumps out of the scoop sometimes when you're shaking it like this. Oh, it's a shell. Not even a coin. There it is. <laughs> Anyways. Sun's going down. We got two other guys here now. Same two guys that were here last night. I knew they'd be back. I thought they'd be tired out. This is our third night here. <laughs> Anyways, I hope Jordan found something by now. But using the Excalibur would be kind of hard in this spot because you just have to dig everything. And the signals are just crazy. The only reason I got stuff is because I was I was cheating. And only digging the good signals. Now I'm digging everything and I already got another big ring because of it. Uh, I wouldn't have even dug that ring earlier because it came up like a penny. Alright, 
There's the sunset, the waves, and I'll probably see you guys when I get home, unless I find something else cool. All right, I got an 11 here, 10. It's right in the middle of some other signals though. Got it on the first scoop. Now let's find a good spot where there's no signals. That's almost impossible. <laughs> Make sure there's no waves. All right, let's check it. Yep, 10 11. Uh, I don't see anything gold. Uh, let's just scrape it up. I got it in my hand, whatever it is. Yep, I feel something. Or maybe not. Yeah, maybe it's something. Just too dark for me to see it. <laughs> I'm not sure. Yeah, some kind of maybe a hem weight or something. I don't know. Okay, it's wrap up time. Um, what an amazing hunt. It really truly was. Um, well, let's just get right into it. I got lots of fishing weights, um, lots of screws and stuff. And I was digging that stuff because I was looking for gold. My intentions were to just dig all the change out of there, but as you could tell, it was impossible. There was too much change. Um, anyways, I got 19 pennies. I got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 79 nickels. 79 nickels. That's insane. That's the most nickels I've ever dug. I'm sure of it. I got 10, 20, 27 dimes. I got 10, 20, 30, 4 quarters. I got this foreign coin here, or token. I'm not sure which. Uh, it is, I got, it's a night, says 1976 on it, this little, uh, looks like a tag or something, because it's lead, um, got some keys, and a little fishing thing, uh, got this piece here, I think it's stainless steel, got this necklace here, it's metal, I don't know what the, this one could be gold, but I don't think so. It doesn't stick to a magnet, but it doesn't look quite right. Oops, sorry. I mean, it could be gold. It tests as gold, but it's probably just plated. So there's that. And this one also tests as gold on 10K. So I don't know, but it has the green on it. So, But you know, those. if it's been down there long enough, 10K can get green. Got this puzzle piece here. It's got the little hole on top, so it was on a necklace. Really haven't had a chance to check that. Um, I think that's everything on the table. Let's get to the good stuff. Uh, start with this. 14K. I don't know what it goes to. I don't know what the heck it is. But, it's gold. <laughs> <laughs> I got a, this big old silver ring here. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I got this little guy with pink and maybe a diamond in there. I haven't tested this one yet because I was too excited about the other ones. Um, but it is 14K. 14 karat gold ring. <laughs> um, this piece here says 14k right on it and I tested it but it's real thin real light I mean not real light but and that was on this chain which we thought was probably fake turns out it's real that's a real chain I mean now that it's all like loose in my hand I can tell I checked the end where it was broke it's all gold 
I tested it, it's 14K. That's a lot of gold right there. Then we got this little guy here, which isn't so little. I forget the weights on these things, but they're, they weigh. Um, this is 14K for sure. Tested. No, I didn't even test it. I already know this is 14K. It's just so obvious. So that's a nice pile of gold. I got this uh, 10K glass ring. I don't know how the camera's working right now. I had to switch. My GoPro's acting up. This is my second time doing this tape. But look at all that green on there. But it is 10K gold. And then last but not least, I got this one thinking it, oh, that that can't be real. You know, it's too way too nice. Guess what? 18 karat gold. Real diamonds. Real sapphires. That's a lot of diamonds around there. Uh, remember the back of it? You can see where it was, si somebody had resized it. But yeah, look at the holes in the back. Woohoo! That, that, that. Let us go in the sun. That is an amazing ring. I'll have to get it appraised. I don't know how much it's actually worth. But when I weighed it, just the gold weight alone is like three hundred and eighty something dollars just for the just for being eighteen karat and heavy. Just it's heavy. I mean it's a heavy ring. Great fine. Probably maybe one of the best. Until I get it appraised, I don't know. That might be one of my best finds. Amazing. Amazing. I am just so happy you don't even know. And, uh... Oh, yeah. Oops, I just dropped one. Dang it. Uh, sorry about the angle of the shot there. I got these two yesterday. Well, you probably saw it in the video. And uh, 14K and 10K class ring. I was super happy with these. Add that, all of that, that, these couple. Oh my gosh, I got so much gold here. Look at all that. Look at all that gold. That's a whole pile. That's over an ounce. Easy. Over an ounce of gold. So, two days in weight alone, $1,200. I weighed, weighed everything and checked the prices. $1,200 just in weight. That ring is going to be worth more because of all those diamonds and the sapphires. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Pretty amazing. You think I'm going to go back today? You're darn right I am. <laughs> I can't wait to get back down there and I'm beat. My back is sore. I'm just going to do slow digging. And just keep going. And I'm sorry I couldn't post these videos, but uh, you can see why. I want to get as much of this yellow stuff as I can. Love the yellow. All right, well, thank you guys for watching. And I did hit 10,000 subscribers, so I'm going to do something. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm thinking about going to the casino and go live and let you guys watch me lose or win my money. Um, I'm not going to be using money from that. I have a little extra money that I can go I saved for. Um, I try to, when if I go to the casino, it's money that I've saved that I can just blow, you know. And, uh, I mean, like, I'll use this change and stuff. There's a lot more change here on the table. Stuff like that. I got cans I save. And they give me free play and free uh, buffet, free restaurants. So it's like kind of a fun thing for me to do. Change it up a little. I don't do it very often and that's all <laughs> I'm just I just can't wait to get back down there I mean it's gonna be a lot of work but I'm gonna do it all right I'll catch you guys in the next one